Okay. Hi, my name is John Gibbons, and today we're going to look at using a muscle energy technique to uh, help a first rib that has either inspirated or was elevated. How might you find this? If I ask the patient to sit a little taller, and what we can do is find a trapezius, almost pull the trapezius back and go inferior to where you perceive the first rib to sit. What I'm going to ask Nick to do is take a breath in, take a deep breath in please, and then when you're ready just slowly breathe out. And then what you're looking for is do the fingers equally rise, and then as he breathes out, do the fingers equally lower. If the answer is yes, then there is no reason to do the next technique. However, on the right side, I felt that the first rib was elevated. Think about the lower cervical plexus, as in the brachial plexus between C5 and T1, conjoined with the, uh, the vascular system, which is the subclavian artery, so it's known as the neurovascular bundle. So if you do happen to have the first rib that's elevated, then potentially the patient might have what we call a thoracic outlet type of, of sim symptoms. Now, how we do this, I'm going to place my leg under, I took my shoes off, under his left arm, and my MCP joint, metacarpal phalangeal joint here, is going to come on to this area here. And what I'm going to do is apply a little bit of inferior pressure but from here I'm going to slowly drift him over laterally so this next side bends so the tissue soften. And what I'm going to get you to do Nick is can you slowly push your head to the left push your head to the left, that's it. So he's activating the left trapezius causing the right tissues to soften through inhibition. After about 8 to 12 seconds, let us have a relax please. Take a breath. And as he breathes out, that joint is going to slowly apply pressure as I cause a shift on the out breath. So you can see I'm shifting him over and the pressure is coming down onto that first rib. And I will hold him for a few seconds. I'm going to ease him off a little bit. Nick, can you side bend your head again to the left, please? After 10 seconds, relax, take a breath in. And as he breathes out, on the out breath and out breath only, I'm going to side shift him and apply inferior pressure down to our first rib. This would be done between two to four times. Let's retest after twice. So we assess him, we treat him, and now we will retest. Take a breath in. So the rib rises and breathe out and the rib lowers. So that'll be an entity for the first rib. For further information, look on www.johngibbonsbodymaster.co.uk. Thank you.